Hello and welcome to this video tutorial. Today we're looking at the often very difficult process of refreshing a browser window. Typically this will happen when you update your website and the changes that you're expecting to see are not flowing through. Well, there are some simple ways and there's a more complex way. We're going to go through the very simple ones first of all. Inside Chrome, there's this refresh button here. You can click on it and see if that helps. If you control click, you will get a different result. So control clicking is the first thing to look at. Now you can also control F5. So you're going to hold down the control key and hit function key F5. And that's another option that you can take inside Chrome. Now, if you're on the Mac, the commands that you'll use are Command, Shift and R, Command, Shift, R. But you can also use the Shift key with this icon in the Chrome window on Mac and that will do the same thing. Swinging over to Firefox, we've got the Reload button here. You can try Shift clicking on that and you can also try Control clicking on that. See if any of those get you the result that you're looking for. You can also try Command, Shift and R. That's a key stroke, Command, Shift, R that you can use on the Mac for Firefox. Let's go back to Chrome because if you're really still having problems and believe me, that's happened to me on a number of occasions, this is going to be your solution. So what you're going to do is hold down the Control key and the Shift key and you're going to tap the letter I. That's I for Italy. And what that does is it opens up this panel over here. The result of opening that panel up is that additional options appear underneath this reload. So if I right click on it, I get a normal reload, I get a hard reload, or I can empty the cache and hard reload. So let's just hard reload. But if that didn't work, then you could go ahead and do the other one. You could empty the cache and then hard reload. Now, if none of those work, let's go across here to the network panel. And underneath network here is an option that is disable cache. So you're going to click on that to disable the cache and then again, go back, right click here and do your hard reload. One of those hopefully is going to get you out of trouble. I find that the very process of opening this developer panel here in Chrome and using the hard reload generally solves my problem. Your mileage may vary. Hopefully something here will solve your problem. When you're done with this, there's a little close icon up here that will get rid of that so you don't have to look at it anymore. I hope this video has been of help to you. If you did enjoy it, please give it a thumbs up, hit the subscribe button and the notification bell and you'll be alerted when new videos are released. Until next time, my name's Helen Bradley. Thank you so much for joining me here on my YouTube channel.